Superfood Evolution presents Propolis. What makes it a prized superfood? Propolis, Resina propoli, is a resinous material made by honeybees and some stingless bees to seal and protect the beehive from the elements, pests, and harmful microbes. It has been highly valued by healers and herbalists alike for its many profound properties to humans when consumed or used topically. On the list with other prized bee-derived superfoods like royal jelly, bee pollen, and honey, it has been utilized in the folk tradition of apotherapy for a very long time, and for one main use we will soon discuss. What is propolis made from? Bees gather resin or sap from mostly trees, but sometimes other plant sources. They create propolis by blending in some of their own salivary discharges and beeswax into this collected material. Minute amounts of bee pollen and honey may also make their way in. Crude bee propolis as a straight substance is waxy, soft, pliable, and of course very sticky. It's commonly called bee glue because it's used as a sealant to bind the hive structure together, fill in gaps, as well as insulate, but it also contains antimicrobial compounds that keeps the beehive sterile and the colony healthy. Propolis as a result contains many healthful qualities that have been found over the ages to offer benefits as a dietary supplement to humans when ingested. Propolis processing for use as a dietary supplement. Raw propolis must be processed before human consumption is possible. Typically, when preparing propolis in its natural state for supplemental purposes, it must go through a process to remove the beeswax, other organic matter, and essentially make it more absorbable to the human digestive tract. However, after this refinement, it is very dense and can harden like obsidian, becoming brittle at temperatures below 68 degrees Fahrenheit. Refined propolis at this stage is always solvent extracted, frequently using alcohol or propylene glycol. This could be a ratio of 1 to 2 parts propolis to 1 to 4 parts solvent. Suppliers may advertise these ratios and include terms like ultra strength or pure. This procedure reduces some of the inert compounds, thus condensing more of the desired nutritional components. The end result is a thick, concentrated tar-like material, often called a maximum potency or full potency propolis. It smells a bit like honey with an earthy aroma. It is not sweet, however. It is sold in a dark liquid form or dried with other ingredients, often carob powder, to make propolis powder or capsules. A straight powder or liquid extract cannot be consumed directly as it will stick to the teeth. It must be diluted using honey, water, or another liquid. While most propolis is usually a darker brown color, sometimes green or red varieties are available as supplements. These are derived from plant sources in Brazil, as well as other parts of Latin America. Chemical Composition of Propolis When it comes to most bee products, like propolis, the exact chemical composition can vary widely depending on the season, hemisphere collected, hive location, and other factors. Bees, being opportunists, will gather from all available sources. In both large-scale and small-scale commercial production, these sources are sometimes controlled as the bees will only gather within a certain range. Often this propolis-specific region will include tree species known for exuding prolific sap production. While it can be difficult to deduce the exact constituents coming from any one propolis source, generally most are known to be comprised of many similar complex compounds and nutrients that account for its comparable properties and uses throughout human history. According to some science, raw unprocessed propolis on average contains about 50% resins, 30% waxes, 10% essential oils, 5% bee pollen, and 5% of various organic compounds. The majority of the bioactive components in propolis are in the resins in the form of polyphenols, chiefly phenolic acids and flavonoids. Two common phenolic flavonoids found in propolis in different ratios often include pinosembrin and pinobanksin, but there are many others. 
propolis benefits and its main prized folk use. Propolis benefits mostly revolve around its strong antimicrobial nature, as well as its antioxidant and anti-inflammatory activities. Here is the main way it is traditionally utilized. Immune and Respiratory Support By far, the top known age-old folk use for propolis is its immune supporting potential. It is often used as an antimicrobial, with other botanicals in formulas designed to boost and protect these functions. It's therefore a good one to have on hand in your herbal apothecary for periodic use when feeling on the verge of sickness or immunocompromised. Much the same way propolis disinfects the beehive from unwanted pathogens, it also offers a similar benefit as a dietary supplement to fend off undesirable microbes. A propolis and honey combination has likewise been researched for its potential influence on certain health-related conditions. You can commonly find propolis supplements in wellness sections of many health food stores here in the U.S. They are frequently used as an ingredient in honey, often with bee pollen and royal jelly. But if you're looking for the highest propolis potency, we recommend getting straight propolis extract. Propolis is also an ingredient in many herbal and supplement products that also offer support to the upper respiratory tract and congestion in this region. We add it to our own homemade herbal cough syrup recipe that also includes other clear breathing favorites like El Campaign, Ginger, Marshmallow, Saw Palmetto, Licorice Root, and Star Anise. B propolis is also a classic ingredient used by many herbalists when making do-it-yourself throat sprays, lozenges, or immune support formulas. Supplement brands often utilize it with other botanicals such as golden seal and echinacea. For more on propolis benefits for skin care and oral health, visit the card above or the description box of this video. Precautions Bee products should not be given to young children and may cause allergic reactions for some people. Consult a physician before taking propolis if you are pregnant, nursing, taking medications, or have a medical condition. Thanks for watching! For more detailed info on propolis, as well as top quality trusted sources, be sure and follow the links in the description box below this video. Please support the channel by giving this video a thumbs up if you found it useful. And be sure and check out these other interesting videos.